yours? You getting an early start? Uh, no, I'm actually doing a live stream. Oh. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Good evening, everybody. My name is Jinx the Bonesaw, and this is a live stream. So get personal with Jinx the Bonesaw. Or don't. Uh, just stay at home and don't watch anything. I don't really care. Don't forget about Acoustic Night at the Oasis Club. And remember, y'all ain't shit. Uh-oh. That's not good. Well. Um, I move this thing. Not getting enough light? No, it's a, a signal. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> signal. Yeah, it's always yeah. signal. Yeah, well. I'm surprised when I ever get a signal around here. Yeah, well, yeah, in the middle of the desert and shit. <laughs> Out in the middle of nowhere. You guys can walk with me. Da, 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 da. Okay, cool. Maybe it's a little bit better over here. What's up, Jeff? Blazing sun, that's just too fucking bright, ain't it? Bear with me, y'all. Hmm. I don't want to rotate the screen. Uh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. See how that does. That's a little bit better. Right? Hmm. There's something I could try to prop this thing up on. Isn't there some trash over here I could use? <laughs> Story of my life. I'm stealing this trash. This art. Trash. Trash art. Sup? Hi, guys. I'm trying to get this. It's, you know, everything's difficult in Slab City. Everything that you do takes... 15 million more steps before you can get that one significant thing done. So. <laughs> Alright. Oh, oh, wait. Ooh. All right, sweet. This should totally freaking help. You're funny, Ben. Said you're not original at all, so fuck off. Yes, I do. Anyway. Poor people don't have any friends. Yeah, you like that? Yeah. I actually got that out here, totally free. <laughs> <laughs> So this is a live stream like right before we have acoustic night here at the Oasis Club, if you guys can see. This is our little uh, desert oasis. Beautiful. It's where we usually have coffee in the morning because like we might be homeless. Well, houseless. But we need coffee. So it's a pretty nice place, dude. Good place to mingle and hang out and all that. So I figured I'd soak up the sun and uh, do the live stream before that. And then, you know, you guys could throw up some questions or some shit. I don't know what I'm doing uh, on this all, at all. <laughs> really just winging it the whole time. Should be good proof that you don't need to plan anything. There's no point. Just wing it. <laughs> so, in case y'all didn't know, well, there's still three of you. I'm Jinxie Bonesaw. I do the range uh, in Slab City. <laughs> Good. 
Hi, bro. Good morning. While I was walking down the street, when out the corner of my eye, I saw a pretty little thing approaching me. Said I never seen a man oh, look so all alone. Now could you use a little company? And if you pay the right price, your evening will be nice, and maybe I can find some Gatorade. Still leave some. You're such a sweet young thing. Why do you do this to yourself? And she looked at me. Where's it at? This is what she said. She said there ain't no rest for the wicked. I don't grow on trees. I got bills to pay and I got miles to feed, and ain't nothing in this world for free. I can't slow down, I can't hold back, though you know I wish I could. No rest for the wicked till we close our eyes for good. Pass and I was walking down the street when I saw a shadow of a man creep out of sight. He from behind, he put a gun to my head. He made it clear he wasn't looking for a fight. I said, Give me all you got, I want your money, not your life. But if you try to make a move, I'll think twice. But you know, I said, You can have my cash, but you know, I gotta ask, what makes you wanna live this kind of life? Ain't no rest for the wicked. They don't grow on trees. I got bills to pay and I got mouths to feed. And ain't nothing in this world for free. I can't slow down. I can't hold back. Though you know I wish I could. Ain't no rest for the wicked. Till we close our eyes for good. Passed and I was sitting in my house, and the day was winding down and coming to an end. I looked at the TV and flipped it up to the news, and what I saw I almost couldn't comprehend. I saw a pretty man in cuffs, he taking money. Off. I can't say much, yes, I know we're all the same. All we all seek out to satisfy those thrills. Cause there ain't no rest for the wicked, they don't grow on trees. I got bills to pay and I got mouths to feed and ain't nothing in this world for free. I can't slow down, I can't hold back, though you know I wish I could. Ain't no rest for the wicked until we close our eyes for good. I should take this thing up on stage, man. It's kind of sweet. <clears throat> How is the signal in here? Is it a crappy signal? Man, you gotta stay hydrated. Hey, Burl, are you staying hydrated? Okay. That's all you can do is try, really. Signal's good, sweet, thanks, man. It's impossible to find a signal in the middle of the damn desert. Sweet, sweet.
I just heard somebody say my dog's name. Talent show is this week, and actually that's the whole reason for this live stream, is to tell you guys that um, uh, tomorrow night we have Ralph E. White, which that'll be live streamed. Uh, Friday was actually a band that, that I got to book, which is uh, Moxie and Loon. Moxie and Loon, they are fucking sick, dude. Uh, dude plays like a drop C slide guitar with like a, a, a drummer, so it's a two-piece band. But they're very bluesy, very sweet, and like I get to play spoons with the dude who plays guitar a couple weeks ago, and it's really, so really sweet. He's a, he's a really good musician. Plus, he's like kind of cute too. Um, and then of course there's the talent show, the 12-hour talent show, 12 hours. Man. Anyway, so 12 hours of a talent show, that's noon to midnight, uh, everything, everything from music to art to inventions to um, uh, juggling, um, like, I don't know, sword swallowing, I don't think people do that out here, I really hope no one tries on this stage. I'm not sure if there's enough talent in the celebs for a 12 hour show. Uh, we just keep going back over the list if there's not enough, because it goes from noon to midnight regardless. Um... Yeah, 12 fucking hours, man. That's like... Uh, I hope I at least get to take a break. I took a break last year, though, so... And then, of course, we have open mic every single Saturday. So it's kind of the same thing as a talent show, but, you know, not 12 hours. And there's a winner, I believe, at the end of the talent show. I think. Relays certificate of appreciation. I don't know. Builder Bill handles a lot of that stuff, so I I'm still working my way very slowly into that. You know. <laughs> Stuff. So yeah, if you don't make it out for the talent show, we always have open mic. Definitely come down and see open mic. At least three. I know, I said the same thing. At least three intermissions for a 12-hour show. I don't even think I took a pee last year. Like, I literally did the show the whole way through. Whew. That would be. Heck yeah, you'll be there. <laughs> you better be there. <laughs> All right, play you guys another song. Oh, in case uh, I didn't tell you guys before, Acoustic Night is tonight uh, at the Oasis Club. There probably won't be enough light for me to, to live stream that, plus it's a little more personal, so, you know, if you want to check that out, you actually have to come to Slab City. But uh, definitely, every single Saturday we do open mic uh, at the range. The range, my favorite desert venue. Um, and then the Saturday talent show, Friday is Moxie and Loon, and then Thursday is Ralph E. White, so, and Ralph is pretty excited. So it's going to be a good, a good weekend. A long weekend, but a good weekend. Um. <laughs> I hope your kiddo gets better. And I totally understand. Who the hell just called me Jenny X? Who are you? That's from a whole nother lifetime. Whole nother lifetime. How's your dog bite? Some people just came in. Hi. Hi, Jim. How you doing? Hi, Cy. I heard you a bit. I'm gonna live stream so if you don't want to be oh, sorry. Yeah, if you don't want to. I mean, you can if you want to, but like. Hey, everybody. Come on. <laughs> That's Jim. Uh, the amazing uh, characters right, we have in Slab City. That reminds me, you guys want to hear my Slab song? I'm gonna play the Slab song. <laughs> so I haven't played it enough. Yeah, yeah, you know Jimbo. <laughs> oh, fucking Slap City. <laughs> when I was down in Georgia, I was on the fence. I told him to bring their arts and inventions to the talent show. But thanks, Bill. So yeah, art, uh, inventors, um, a mad scientist, uh, if you have poetry, if you have um, spoken word, if you, like, any kind of talent you can think of, except for um, anything dirty that we can't actually show, uh, like, 
children. Yeah. So like, fellatio is not really a talent. <laughs> As I was, I was literally asked that earlier this week. Not a talent. Doesn't count. Okay. Um, but I mean, um, eating 50 hot dogs in one sitting is totally a talent. We're not going to supply the hot dogs, but totally a talent, I guess. <laughs> Whatever. Bring your talents. Appreciate yourselves and show us what you got at the talent show. Uh, this coming weekend is coming Saturday from noon to midnight. <laughs> when I went out to Georgia, I was on the fence. Uh, oh, it depends on the nudity. It depends on what kind of nudity that it, uh, it is. I don't even think I know an ACDC song, just, just so you know. I, I, don't, think I, I don't know any ACDC, ACDC songs. I think the song I know... Nope, not even close. Whatever. Fuck it, listen to this one. <laughs> or carve a tiki with a chainsaw. That was actually, I believe, featured last year. When I was in the Experiences is help me write that song. And it has been a long four years. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'll take the hat off for this one. <sighs> it's like the only song I've really ever written, so yeah, that's that's the gist of it. I got other ones in the works, but it's hard to write a song. I didn't really practice writing a lot. <clears throat> so, you should practice writing, because you never know when you're actually going to use it later on in life. Totally practice writing, creative writing, um, in your penmanship. Because nobody could read your writing. What the fuck's the point? You think you can take a bong hit break? Sure. about your hair. What is that even supposed to mean? Wait, wait, wait. I think it's one of the songs I have. It's another cover. <clears throat> I don't care what's in your hair. I just want to know what's on your mind. I know, a folk song talking about a time and place. What? Kidding. Crazy. Uh... Yeah, yeah, the song yesterday was, um, um, 
What was that? I think it was some. Um, I think that is a. It's a Twenty One Pilots cover, but I don't think I. Well, you probably seen it yesterday. Didn't sing it yesterday. Maybe you did. I don't know. I, I don't. I don't know. But it could have been that Twenty One Pilots cover, which is like a love song. I sort of. I like wooed a girl off on, on like in the crowd with it one one year. It was good. It was good. I didn't get laid, but you know, it's still something. <laughs> sing a song about the devil because I don't have the other things so it's hard for me to sing that song but I will definitely sing it at some point because I don't have my I don't have my ukulele my banjo lately I just have the full out banjo with the cause sticker look at that that's a shout out to cause yeah 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 um I don't care what's in your hair I just want to know what's on your mind I used to say I want to die before I'm old but because of you I might think twice I don't care what's in your hair. I just want to know what's on your mind. I used to say I want to die before I'm old, but because of you, I might think twice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can't play it on this, but. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool, man. I love when songs get stuck in my head. And if you carry it with you for the rest of the day, that's cool. I love inspiring people and, like, uh,. And that's all I really want is to inspire people. So if that song helps you to sing in the shower and it inspires you to sing in the shower, in the car, or pick up an instrument, that's all that, that's all that really matters. Because it changed my life, so. Who's to say it won't change yours? Mm. I wish I get this, like, popped up a little bit more so you guys can see the rest of the Oasis Club as people trickle in. Um, There's some more garbage. I wish I could use some more garbage. Yeah, there we go. That's better. All right. There. Now there's the whole rest of the Oasis Club. See? That's great. <laughs> I've only sang with Builder Bill once, and it was uh, it was actually for his um, his uh, range song. Um, I don't know how that one goes. Um, Thing. You gotta, uh, I'll, I'm not gonna do that right now. <clears throat> 17 people, wow, that's, that's, that's kind of cool, I guess. Like actual people, because there's just a number with a little like out, outline of a head and uh, shoulders. <laughs> oh my god. So Bill, Bill uh, introduced me to this song. It's by the uh, the uh, what is it? Bridge City Sinners. Yeah, the Bridge City Sinners. That's who it's by. And it's a it's it's a good song, but uh, it's called Pussycat. So if you guys get a chance, you should totally check that shit out because it's an interesting song. Uh, and that band is like blowing the fuck up too. Like seriously blowing the fuck up. I put it like this so against that. I just can't amp up the table at all. Can't bump the table at all. You know, Jordan said he was gonna be here 10, 15 minutes at the most. It has been uh, 25. <laughs> Damn it, Bill, now I got that song stuck in my head with the with the Pussycat song. Did you look it up? No, seriously, Bridge City Centers, Pussycat, it's a good song. Yeah, there's no other banjo players though. What's up, son? I see, I can't play that in this thing. Right? <clears throat> Song about the devil. Please allow me. To introduce myself, I'm a woman of wealth and taste. I was round for a long, long year, stole many a man's soul and faith. Fuck 
Fuck yeah, Bill. You got the chords and the words. Bring that shit tonight. I was around when Jesus Christ had his moment of doubt and pain. Made damn sure the pilot washed his hands and sealed his face. Pleased to meet you. Hope you guess my name. Nature of mine. <laughs> Stuck around in St. Petersburg when I saw it was time for a change. Killed the Tsar and his minister. Anastasia screamed out in vain. Damn, it's hungry garbage. Wrote a tank for general's rank when the Blitzkrieg rage and the body stank. Pleased to meet you. Hope you guess my name. Nature of mine. The gods they made. And I shout it out. Tree that was uh, that was the Rolling Stones cover, "Sympathy for the Devil." Um, uh, uh, I keep having brain farts. You know you shouldn't smoke weed before you try to do a live stream, but whatever. Free place to live. I do what I want. I do what I want. The uh, big tree is actually for our fire because we usually have a fire pit, and it's like right over there. See, there's the fire pit over there. So we have a fire going because you know musicians' fingers get cold, and if our fingers get cold, then we can play music. Yeah, I got a Batman sticker on my banjo. Boom. I also got a La Machina. L.A. Machina. See that one right there? Boom. That was the, well, it's backwards, but that was the band that was here, um, Friday? Yeah, Friday. Friday, they were here Friday. Um, they were sick. Uh, L.A. Machina was really, really sweet. All-girl punk band. So it was an all-girl run show because I was the only one doing sound. So, uh, I actually don't use picks at all. I don't use, I just... It's just my hands. These hands, though. 
I, uh, I don't know, I've never used a pick. I actually have a pin on a hat that, that's like a, it's like an anti-pick pin, so. Yeah. I have, uh, I do have thumb picks and finger picks, you know, for playing the banjo and stuff, but I don't use them, I just give them to other musicians, you know, whoever needs them, that kind of stuff. People are starting to file in for the acoustic night, so I try to keep it going as long as I can, but, you know, I'm on a short battery, like, well, not short battery, but a regular battery, it takes fucking forever to get signals, so it just kills it for the live stream. So we either go until there's no more light, or there's no more battery, or there's no more jinxie, but I don't see me going anywhere, so... Their first album drops this spring. Dude, they were so, so sick. Like, Ellie Machina was sick. Sticky Doll was sweet, too. Plus, they did that Queens of the Stone Age cover. But, like, Ellie Machina was, was too, too fucking sick for words. And, like, Susie Moon, she played so fucking rough that her fingers started bleeding. Left-hand bassist. Sick shit. Hi, Sticks. Man. Yeah, it was, it was, it was a good show. We've only, uh, we've had a couple really good shows like that. Like, uh, uh, uh what is that, uh... Jitan Damon uh, Quartet came out. Thanks. I found it at the range. Um, they came out. That, that's Rika Agnew's um, partner, wife, whatever you want to call him. Um, he's with the Rattle Lessons. But they're a, a sweet band. She's an amazing singer. I mean, like, some of like notes that I've never heard anybody make before. And they're really cool on stage, too. Yeah, they were the music. No, L.A. Machina was totally, they were so sick. It's like kind of the whole reason for that show. Even though it was the Fuck It Fest, like number three, um, it's still like they made that show all day. All day, like the Hasbins were cool. And uh, was it Antisocial was a good band, but like Ellie Machina. It, Pigeon Toad, he was a sweet rapper. I did not see him uh, coming up on stage and doing any of that shit. But Ellie Machina was where it was at. Those girls, man, girl power. All right. Um, what else do I got for you? I was trying to wait for somebody to show up so I could do the Inema song because I've been doing like a bunch of different Tool covers, which like to cover Tool is like covering Led Zeppelin. Like you either ace it or you die. Like, <laughs> end of story. <laughs> so, but uh, there are a lot of really, really easy chords actually. though that's not it. I wonder why bassist left stage as she did yeah she literally did like uh, there's uh, I think uh, smashing good time got a clip of her playing there's just blood spewed all over her fucking bass too hot to handle too too hot to handle she was really she's really cool too she came by last last year and she's very sweet uh, and and like um not like too full of herself that's cool that you drummed a tool yeah I tattooed a tool because why tattooed anything else I love Tool. It's like, it probably, yeah, my favorite band. Besides myself. Because you gotta love yourself. Let's go look and see. This is a damn shame. It's a damn shame. Bye, Joyce Sorrow. Hope to see you soon. Stay feral.
soon. I certainly hope we will. I sure could use a vacation from this stupid shit, silly shit, stupid shit. One great big festering neon distraction. I have a suggestion to keep you all occupied. Learn to swim. Learn to swim. Learn to swim. Mom's gonna fix it all soon. Mom's coming round to put it back the way it ought to be. No bump it. No bump it. it all go down. Mom, please flush it all away. I want to see it go right in and down. I want to watch it go right in. Watch you flush it all away. song. I really do. Streaming ball. Everyone can see this. Six to fifteen people. <laughs> that was shy. That's my spoon man. Spoon man. Wish I could play that song. Spoon Man, sweet. I can, however, uh, play Burden in My Hand. I can play Black Hole Sun. Oh yeah, I think uh, learning other people's music is like, um, thank you. Thank you for uh, for appreciating the music that I'm playing right now. <laughs> it's really awkward. But, uh, and, you know, trying to ignore it. But, uh, what are they saying? Fuck. Obviously, it wasn't that important. Oh no, that's what it was. Um, I like playing other people's music because it sort of helps you get a feel for different chords and things like that. So you can convey the the music that you're coming up with or you're writing to other people, so that they can in, in turn like use that to express themselves. So, because all I want is people to express themselves. If you express how you feel, if you express who you are, it helps you to not have to lie to yourself, uh, which will very slowly make you implode. From the inside out. Because, like, expression is one of the things that saved my life. If I couldn't, like, show how I feel or show who I am, like, in Babylon, I started to, to just 
like self-destruct. I call it Babylon because no one there speaks the same language. So thanks for tuning in from Babylon. Or from across the slabs or wherever the hell you guys are at. You guys are all awesome. That's kind of scary. I didn't say that. I know. I've been one of them. I'm going to mute the mic. I'm going to mute the mic. There's too much light. I want to remind everybody we have a really long weekend. Thursday is Ralphie White. Friday is Moxie and Loon. And Saturday is the 12 hour talent show. Be there or be a trapezoid. Yeah. Yeah, I'm exhausted. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. You can polish a turd, you know? You are a jinx here. Thanks, man. That's awesome. That's awesome. I'm really glad to hear that. Foraging seeker. Yep. I'm from Australia. That's sweet. I used to know this one cat from Australia. He was a he was a sick cunt. That's for sure. He was really cool. Like probably one of my better friends. From Boston. That's what's up. And somebody like left me a, a like a comment on one of these videos. It was like, hey, greetings from Poland. I'm like, what? That's crazy. But uh, social media makes it really easy to kind of reach other people all the way across everywhere. Um, yeah. And for that, I'm thankful for social media. From Ohio? I'm from Ohio. Of course I talk to Kaz. I live, like, within the same square mile as him. <laughs> no, Kaz is a good dude. I like Kaz. In fact, uh, there's a sticker. See that on the head of my banjo? Bam. <laughs> balancing thing. Yeah, Kaz is, Kaz is cool as fuck. Kaz is definitely cool as fuck. Northern California, fuck yeah, fuck yeah. I worked on a pot farm in Northern California up in like Redding, Horning area. This Rancho Tehima. There's a lot of crazy fucking hill people up there. Oh, you work at a farm too? Is it a pot farm or is it like an agro farm? <laughs> Yellow Springs, Ohio. <laughs> yeah, and you can even share music. It's amazing. It's not, yes, it's very nice to not have to buy pot. <laughs> that was my favorite thing about working on the pot farm. Plus it was for it was for friends of mine, so I got to see like the whole thing sort of pan out, and yeah, got to see them um, like at least from clone to finished product. You know. Oh yeah, yeah, we're starting to lose a little bit of light here, but keep it going as long as we can. Twenty people? What? That's, uh, that's I think it's the most I've seen in a chat room that I've had, uh, or at least the live stream that I've had. Twenty-one. That's the most right there. If you're just tuning in, and we'll let you guys know about the talent show this Saturday, so that'll be live streamed. Um, there might be an intermission just because like battery sucks because we live in the middle of nowhere, um, and your phone's constantly searching for a signal. But also Friday, there's Moxie and Loon, which is uh, a band that I booked, and like I haven't booked anybody at the range um, in I think two years. The last person that I booked was a really good friend of mine. Uh, his name's Ivan. His name was uh, why well, it's still Ivan, but. Um, yeah, Ivan Dawson, he was a huge inspiration for me to pick up music. An amazing musician. Uh, he played guitar and he had a list when he sang, so it was like, it was really, really cool. Um, yeah, he wasn't, um, you know, we talked a lot about like drug addiction and like uh, suicide and things like that. And I had sent him a message and found out that he had already kind of like uh, passed away. They found him dead in his, in his, uh, yeah, in his, um, in his house, so I really didn't book anybody at the range for like two years because I was having a hard time with dealing with that because um, he was an amazing individual, so beautiful, but so tormented, and that's why he was such a fucking good musician. Like, it takes living the blues to sing the blues, you know what I mean? So, but, uh, 
wants. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not going to sing first at the talent show. Then I got to sing it at noon. <laughs> yeah. Man. It sucks to have to like uh, remember people who passed away. You know. Like Ivan was awesome. He actually he is actually the one who um, gave me the idea for the chords for the slab song. So. Yeah. Love you, Ivan. Oh yeah. When you were here before like a feather special description and it's not for me it's it's really for the range so because everything I do is for the range <sighs> forgot where I was at but I'm a creep I'm a fucking weirdo what the fuck am I doing here
I learned that from uh, the guy, a cat out here we used to call, Elder Shane. He, he kind of, he learned the song and sang it, because cause some lady out here called him a creep, which I thought was really funny. I love you guys too. Uh, thanks for tuning in. We're running out of sun, uh, so probably going to have to cut it short soon. Yes, it's getting very cold at night. Oh my gosh. Like, uh, like it chills your bones. Uh, my dog doesn't keep me nearly warm enough. Not nearly warm enough. But, here, I'll pick you up. Yeah. So, I'll show you around. Here. Look at this. Look at that. That's the beautiful sunset in Slab City. It's every single day is a beautiful sunset like that. Look at that, it looks like the horizon's on fire. This shit is just awesome. But yeah, uh, keep being inspired. Uh, make sure to check us out uh, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Saturday for the 12 hour, 12 hour talent show. Um, again, Thursday is uh, Ralphie White. Friday is Moxie and Loon, which sick. And uh, Saturday is our talent show. And then, of course, you can check us out every single Saturday, every single Saturday, um, for open mic at the range. So uh, stop on through, check us out, uh, or come to Slab City, you know? Uh, but make sure that you stay feral, be inspired, uh, love often, and um, be human. All right? Love you guys. Peace. Sweet.